Today we celebrate St. Teresa of the Child Jesus. We may be more familiar with two other names for today's saint, Therese of Lisieux and the Little Flower. Her short and in some ways ordinary life offers lessons for us all. Perhaps that's also why her autobiography, The Story of a Soul, is so widely read and known. Reading the life story of the little flower, we learn of her deep belief that all are called to perfection, including little souls, which is how she characterized hers. Teresa spent nine of her 24 years as a Carmelite nun in a cloistered convent in France. There, her days consisted mainly of prayer and hard domestic work. For her, quiet suffering was redemptive suffering. Like so many saints, she sought to serve others and to forget herself in quiet acts of love. She is one of the great examples of the gospel paradox that we gain our life by losing it. The little flower suffered from various illnesses during much of her life, including extended periods of delirium and fainting spells. During the last year of her life, she slowly wasted away from tuberculosis. She was canonized in 1925. In 1997, exactly 100 years after her death, she was named a doctor of the church.